Nowadays, it seems like you can connect just about anything to your smartphone. The front door lock, the thermostat to the house, even refrigerators nowadays can be, well, connected to your smartphone. But in today's video, I've got something special I want to share with you. And it's a project that you can do yourself. I'm going to tell you all about it coming up next. I'm Leah of CJ and Drill, and if this is your first time here, can I just say welcome to ya? We're a home improvement channel where beginners are welcome as well. Now, at the top of the video, I talked about, well, smartphone technology and how nowadays so many of the home systems can be connected to our smartphones. Now, in today's video, I'm going to show you how to connect a do-it-yourself security system and then you'll be able to monitor your security system right from your cell phone. Now many of you may recall that the project home that we recently completed had been vandalized where vandals had broken into the home and had cut out all the copper plumbing not once but twice. Once the project home was completed, my focus became how to keep the house protected. And this is how I did it. And I was able to leave and feel, well, pretty secure that things were gonna remain intact. Now, what I found was a DIY-friendly security system that's easily installed, easily activated, and was reasonably priced. I only paid 209 for my system and it was totally customized to my home. Here's what came in the box. Now naturally you get a keypad. However, I thought it was really important to include two fobs with my system because I wanted there to be remote access to the keypad. Now you do get the one keypad and I placed mine near the door that I frequent most often. There was no need for hardware. The keypad came with double-sided tape. You just peel it off and then place it on the wall in arm's reach of the door. Well, I opted for the thermostat sensor as well because I do a great deal of traveling. I wanna be able to monitor the temperature inside the home remotely from my cell phone and this sensor allows me to do that. Now you want to start off in the room where the thermostat is and you want to attach the sensor right above the thermostat very much like the way you attach the keypad to the wall. Now I decided on three motion detectors for my system. Now this is what they look like outside of the package and they're designed to be placed in the corner and you want to make certain they're right side up. There's a little circle there that lets you know that you're placing the motion detector right side up. Now the other thing is if we flip it over to the back you see where it takes batteries and there's a little switch that controls the sensitivity of the motion detector. Now I placed a motion detector on the first floor, the second floor, and in the basement as well. Now I included three door sensors with my kit. They're easy to install and this is what they look like. You just take them and you press them into place just like the other components but make certain those bars are lined up because that controls the sensor and a little light will come on let you know that the job's done correctly. Now every security system needs a yard sign and one was included in the kit along with a security camera. However, since the house is vacant and there's no internet service, well, it just wasn't possible for me to, well, hook up the security camera at this time. And here we have the brains of the entire system right here. So this is our last component. It's the base station. And unlike the camera, well, it doesn't require internet service. 
it runs solely off Simply Safe's cellular system. You don't need a landline, all you need is your cell phone. Now this truly is the brains of the whole operation. It controls all the sensors and the alarm and it lets well it lets Simply Safe know if you have an intruder in your house. So let's hook this thing up, pull the tabs from all the devices. That's going to activate the batteries. Now all you have to do is plug the base station in grab your cell phone and then follow the prompts entry sensor Added. and it will set up all the devices throughout your home entry sensor named it's just that simple now i'll make certain that i'll leave a link in the description below in the event you want to check this out for yourself this is leah saying you can do this See you next time.